terrifying moments for a woman who woke up to a strange man in bed with her. The woman screamed. Her brother rushed in to help and tried to fight the offender off. That break-in happened early this morning in the 500 block of Webster Drive in Huntsville. WFF 48's Elizabeth Jello caught up with the victim. Elizabeth, emotions were running high. And Mark, the woman, the victim, tells us that a man broke into her house and tried to rape her. Her brother went in and he tried to help her out, but the man got away, leaving behind, though, evidence of his visit. Kelly Dodson was asleep with her little girl inside their apartment on Webster Drive when I was attacked by some idiot from out here in the projects. Dodson says her attacker used a garbage can to climb onto the unit's ledge, open the upstairs window, and then he got in bed with her. He, he tried to rape me. He tried to pull my clothes off. Dodson struggled with her attacker, knocking over items in her bedroom. Antoine Dodson heard his sister scream and ran to help. Well, obviously we have a rapist in Lincoln Park. He's climbing in your windows. He's snatching your people up trying to rape them so y'all need to hide your kids, hide your wife, and hide your husband because they're raping everybody out here. The attacker got loose and went out the upstairs window, but he did leave something behind. We got your t-shirt, you didn't left fingerprints and all. You are so dumb. You are really dumb. For real. A crime scene investigator photographed and dusted for prints on the lid of the garbage can and the window pane and ledge. Dodson says he's never seen the perp before, but sends this warning to whoever is responsible. You don't have to come and confess that you did it. We're looking for you. We we going to find you. I'm letting you know that so you can run and tell that, homeboy. Now, if you have any information on this crime, you're urged to call Huntsville Police Department. We'll have much more from the victims of that attack coming up tonight at 6. Reporting live in Huntsville, Elizabeth General, WAFF 48. Items link below. Proceeds go to the Dodsons and the Gregories and Apple. He's climbing in your windows. He's snatching your people up. Trying to break them. So you need to hide your kids. Hide your wife. Hide your kids. Hide your wife. Hide your kids. Hide your wife. And hide your husband. Because they're raping everybody out here. You don't have to come and confess. We're looking for you. We gon' find you. We gon' find you. So you can run and tell that, run and tell that, run and tell that. Oh boy, oh, oh, oh boy. We got your t-shirt to the left finger prince and all. You are so dumb. You are really dumb, for real. You are really, 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 really so dumb. I was attacked by some idiot in the project. So dumb, so dumb, so dumb, so dumb. He's climbing in your windows, he's snatching your people up, trying to rape them. So y'all need to hide your kids, hide your wife, hide your kids, hide your wife, hide your kids, hide your wife, and hide your husband, because they're raping everybody out here. You don't have to come and confess, we're looking for you, we're going to find you, we're going to find you, so you can run and tell that, 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 run and tell
I tell them we don't run around crying and acting sad. We just dust our shoulders off and keep on moving. Subscribe to Antoine Dodson. Subscribe to Auto to the News. Post to cover up, we can think to it here. Don't forget to buy the song on iTunes. And there are shirts too. For if you like became to an shirts. instant internet sensation. In fact, it's the number one watch video on WAFF.com and YouTube. Antoine Dodson now has a Facebook fan page, t shirt line, even a ringtone. Some also question the decision to let Antoine and his sister tell their story. WFF 48's Elizabeth Gentle joins us live. Elizabeth, no one could have anticipated this kind of attention. And certainly not us, Mark. In fact, we were assigned to find the victim in this case who had been assaulted by a man who broke into her home. The Dodsons welcomed us onto their property and approached us about doing an interview. Some did not agree with Dodson and what he had to say in his interview, but fact is, he is a victim. And just like any other victim, they have the right to speak out. Wednesday, we met Antoine Dodson and his sister Kelly at their apartment on Webster Drive. He says someone broke in, crawled in bed with Kelly, and assaulted her. Antoine heard her scream, tried to help, but the perp got away. Yeah, he just swept my sister all over her road floor, and I, and I think that's terrible. That's ridiculous, and you're going to get caught. But the man got away. Dodson's story ran that night on WAFF 48 News. Within minutes, it became a viral Internet sensation, taking over popular sites like Facebook. Facebook and YouTube. There's a rap version of Dodson's interview. So how does Dodson feel about his newfound fame? I know and I am so glad because I feel like I belong on somebody's TV. Dodson says the situation he and his family went through was terrifying. He was angry the day he talked with us but says he did it to warn his neighbors. Today he's much more calm but says he has no regrets. What people fail to realize is our family, we don't run around crying and acting sad, you know what I'm saying? We just dust our shoulders off and keep on moving. Antoine and his family are scared to stay here at night. The attack has left his sister worried for their safety. Antoine says he didn't do the interview to become a household name. He did it to help try and catch his sister's attacker. Emotions, he doesn't hold back. Pretty much I'm a beat his ass and then I'm going to call the police why I'm beating his ass because I want you to feel what you made my sister feel when you came into her room. Now, some have contacted our newsroom saying that interviews with people like Antoine reflects poorly on the community. To that, I say censoring people like Antoine is far worse. Reporting live in Huntsville, Elizabeth General WAFF 48 News.